Today I'm going to review Pod Pie Volume Zero. Hi, I'm Nicola with another episode in the Pod Pie series. If you don't know what Pod Pie is, it's a treasure box with a bunch of components and a magazine that tells you all about how to use them and how to program them with JavaScript. Inside the treasure box, you get an Argui Arduino board, but it has a special name. It's called the Captain Arduino board, and it's made specifically for this. I'm going to review the magazine today. It's called Volume Zero because a lot of electronic things start with zero, so I think it's pretty cool. It starts off with uh, siblings, Jake and Zoe. They find a treasure box, just like this one, on the ground while they're walking home from school. Inside, there's a bunch of components and a magazine comic book. It's a comic book inside a comic book. It starts to get dark, so they take it home, and then they start setting up their computers. Jake has a PC, a Windows PC, and Zoe has a Mac. So if you have either a PC or a Mac, you can do it along with them. Uh, this page is really cool. It tells you all about the Argu Arduino, so if you don't know very much about it or you're new to it, then that's your page. You can't just use the Arduino right off the bat. You have to set it up first, so this tells you how to do that. Um, oh, so they start working on the first lesson. Uh, Zoe with her Mac and Jake with his PC. And they're siblings, so they kind of tease each other a little bit. Um... They, they decide to work together so Jake can set up the components and Zoe can do the programming. So they're doing the first lesson here where they have a resistor, an LED, and a wire that goes to the ground. And they manage to get it working and Jake's holding it up all, all ta-da! Zoe stops it and she makes a coding cheat sheet. So that way, if you forget what to do, you can always go back to this and just find it again. Oh, this is my favorite part. Captain Arguino, a pod peep, decides to take you on a ship to the island of Pod Pie. We'll get to that later. So, Captain Arguino is a pod peep. A pod peep is a character that's specifically designed to teach you an electronic subject or component. Captain Arguino teaches you about the Arduino. Uh, there's a map. And so you're going to meet Letty, and she's going to teach you all sorts of things on the ship with a couple of other pod peeps, like Volta and Omi. Um, this is the setup page for the Chromebook. It's a little bit easier than the Mac and the PC. Um, this is telling you how the lessons work. I think it's really cool because it's a very good layout. There is, it tells you the, how to set it up on the breadboard up top, tells you the code in the middle, tells you experiments that you can try to do with it and it, you once you get it working it, it's really cool because the first lesson allows you to blink an LED on and off. You meet Volta and then you go on. There's some common mistakes in hardware and software on these on these two spreads. When I was getting started I made quite a few mistakes so this really helped me. And then you might accidentally type something wrong when you're doing software. You go on to doing three LEDs. This is a bit more challenging, but it's really fun once you get it all to work. You go, and this is all about different components, like LEDs, resistors, motors. Oh, so then they meet Reggie. Reggie is, uh, she represents the RGB LED, which is an LED with, that can change colors. There's red, blue, and green. That's why it's called red, red RGB, actually red, green, blue. Next, Volta teaches you about the button. I like experimenting with them because this is the last lesson. So you can take Volta's button maybe and Reggie's RGB LED, and every time you push the button, change her, LED, uh, her RGB. This is what I really like about Pod Pie. It teaches you enough so that you can experiment it with it. There's a Pod Pie Wall of Fame. There's Captain Arguino, and there's people like Servo, too. Next, in the next spread, we have Jake and Zoe looking at the next volume and being ready to start it. That's it for today. If you have any questions, you can go to podpie.com and contact them. They're usually pretty good about it. 
And that's it for today. See you in the next episode. Thank you.